if my rate is on 15 and I'm giving 15 breaths a minute, then all I simply have to do is say 60 seconds divided by 15 means that my total cycle time is four seconds. Now you see what I just did? Now I know how big the piece of the pie is that I'm breaking up like this. You see, now all I have to do is go, okay, four seconds divided by 2.5. Why'd I do 2.5? Because I need to know how many total parts I'm playing with. One part inspiration, one and a half parts exhalation, 2.5 parts total. So all I have to do is this, four divided by 2.5. That means that every part is 1.6. Okay, so four, four seconds divided in two and a half, two, total parts, two and a half. That means that every single part is 1.6 seconds. One part is how much? 1.6 seconds. That means my I time is 1.6 seconds. Now, to get my E time, all I have to do is do 1.6 times 1.5. So I say, okay, 1.6 times 1.5. The answer here, 2.4 seconds. Now, if you ever want to check this, because you're like, that's, that's not how that works. Watch this, 1.6 plus 2.4. If you add I time plus E time, then you get total cycle time. 1.6 plus 2.4 equals four. So it is adding up and it is correct.